Hey guys, I wanted to show you about my Dyson V8 animal I just got. So far, it's been great. Uh, it's sucked up dirt I didn't even know I had. It's sucking up dirt from the future. It's great. Really cleans the floors. These uh, hardwood, linoleum, you name it, it's good. Even the carpet. I mean, after I was done my hardwood floors, I took it on the carpet. And it's really, really cleaned the carpet. But I just bought it, and then I thought I was going to have to return it because it's like shocking the crap out of my hands. And I'll show you that in a second. Like it's real easy. You just lift up on this and then the bottom of the canister opens. You empty it out. It's just really portable. And it's going to work pretty good around here, especially in the uh, truck, car, boat. But anyway, let's uh, go vacuum some carpet. Because I believe that it creates a static charge, either from the carpet or the dirt swirling around inside the canister. I'm not sure, but you'll see on the charging port back here, there will be an arc that comes out of it and hits my hand. Now, I'll do it with the lights out. Like I say, hopefully we can catch it. We'll head upstairs and we'll give it a try on the carpet. Okay, we're upstairs now. I've got my hand on the handle. And uh, we're going to see if we can recreate the static charge. Alright, so here's the carpet I was vacuuming that was giving me the shocks. It's just a carpet in the living room that I have. But um, seriously, uh, that's not right. This thing shouldn't be happening. I guess it's been happening for a while. If it's been happening to you too, let me know what you think. I mean, some of Dyson's responses about this have been crazy. Like, uh, moisturize your hands, wear a glove. So basically... Whenever we've been using this, we do wear a glove because the static shock can be quite uncomfortable and it, and it happens every five or ten seconds. That's the major downfall, but the rest of it's a good vacuum. It's just a shame that they haven't got around to fixing that yet.